He finished as the year-end number one for the third time in his career. In 2014, he won seven titles, including Wimbledon and the Barclays ATP World Tour Finals. Novak Djokovic knows how to dig deep when it matters most. Novak's rivals come no bigger than Roger Federer and Rafael Nadal. For four years running, Djokovic was at number three in the world, behind that formidable pair. In 2011, that all changed, but the first steps had been taken long before. They were dominating the sport for so many years, and I remember I won against both of them in the same tournament uh, back in 2007 in, in Montreal. There was a uh, second big title that I won, so I was very young. Uh, 20 years old and uh, being able to win against top two players in the world in the same tournament was, uh, was a huge achievement and that gave me obviously wings for, for the rest of my career. Next week on ATP World Tour Uncovered, 2015 gets underway in style with all the action from Doha, Brisbane and Chennai. And raring to go, nearing 1,000 match wins, Roger Federer tells us his plans for the season ahead. Don't forget to log on to atpworldtour.com for your 24-7 breaking news. And talk with us on Facebook and Twitter, in English and Spanish. We'll see you next week.